of a two-on-one. Randall goes inside for the slam. Well, now with the three ball. <laughs> that's, that's exactly right, Clyde. <laughs> As Randall knocks down the three. Once I knew it was an option uh, for me to be able to come here and play for the Knicks, it was a no-brainer for me. Offensively since the first quarter. Randall goes strong, disposes of Grant Williams, and Randall. When Julius Randall signed with the Knicks in 2019, there wasn't a lot of excitement. People didn't see it as a major move, and it's fair to say expectations were low. After all, Randall had already been shipped off by the Lakers and wasn't given much value by the New Orleans Pelicans. New York felt like it might be his last chance to make a name for himself in the NBA. Yeah, uh, I mean, for me, it was a pretty easy um, decision once I, uh, once I knew it was an option. Uh, for me to be able to come here and play for the Knicks. It was a no-brainer for me. Um, I think since like my second year in the league, I think it was my first time playing in MSG. And uh, just that feeling of playing in MSG, uh, the excitement, I had no clue what to expect or, or really knew what I was walking into. And, um, you know, that feeling has always like kind of like stuck with me. And I always wanted to, you know, if I ever had a chance to play in New York, I always told my family, I always told my wife, my friends, if I ever had a chance to play for the Knicks that, you know, this would definitely be a no-brainer for me. So for me, it was an easy, easy decision, a quick process. Um, and, you know, I got it done as soon as I could. Randall did something that not a lot of people expected. He bet on himself and he put in the work to transform his game. He didn't just improve, he simply evolved. He became a better shooter, a more versatile scorer, and an above average playmaker. And while some might not see him as an upper echelon star, you can't deny the progress he's made. Now, let's talk about what Randall did for the Knicks. Before he arrived, New York had missed the playoffs for seven straight seasons. The franchise was really struggling, and it didn't seem like anyone wanted to play for the Knicks. They missed out on big name after big name. Randall helped change all of that. He played with passion, wore his heart on his sleeve, and left everything on the court. He even won over the fans, and he made people in the NBA world stand up and pay attention to the Knicks again. His hard work and dedication led to multiple All-Star appearances, and more importantly, he became the face of a franchise during a time when they desperately needed someone to step up. Sure, he had some rough playoff performances, and no one's saying he was perfect, but you can't deny the application he put in, night in and night out. But Julius Randle was a key figure in helping the Knicks turn the ship around. He helped re-establish a winning culture, something that had been missing for a long time in New York. As Randall says goodbye to New York and heads to Minnesota, it's important to recognize the foundation he laid down. The Knicks are now in a much better position to compete for a championship, and a lot of that credit should go to Julius Randle. He made it cool to play for the Knicks again, something that hadn't been the case for many years. He was one of the first players to fully buy into the vision and establish a culture of hard work and dedication. And now, as the Knicks continue to build on that foundation, they have a real shot at success, thanks in large part to what Julius Randle helped start. Now, with the addition of Carl Anthony Towns, the Knicks all of a sudden find themselves as a genuine title contender. So, as Julius Randle moves on to a new chapter in his career, let's not forget what he accomplished with the New York Knicks. He may not have won a title in New York, but his contributions were huge for the franchise. League history might try and gloss over his time with the Knicks, but we won't let that happen. Salute and respect to Julius Randle for everything he did. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Do you think Randle's impacts on the Knicks will be remembered the way it should be? If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more upcoming videos and NBA content. My name is Damien Peters. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.